Good day everyone! Once again, this is Teacher Grace, your online math teacher. Today, I am going to discuss the multiplying decimals up to two decimal places by one to two digit whole numbers. Alright, so example, 2 and 32 hundreds times 5. So, as you can see, yung ating multiplicand na given ay mixed decimal and then yung multiplier natin ay whole number. Oh, so, paano ba siya i-multiply? So, we're going to multiply this given just like how we multiply a whole number and then mamaya, saka na lang natin pag ilalagay, ano? Or saka ko nilang ituturo kung paano ilagay yung decimal point. 5 times 2 is... 10, write down 0, regroup 1, 5 times 3 is 15, plus 1 is 16, write down 6, regroup 1, 5 times 2 is 10, plus 1 is 11. And then, sa paglalagay ng decimal point, we're going to count the number of digits to the right of the decimal point. 1, 2, 1, 2, then the answer is 11 and 60 hundreds. Another given, 3 and 5 tenths times 4. 4 times 5 is 20. Write down 0. Regroup 2. 4 times 3 is 12. Plus 2 is 14. Then, sa paglalagay ng decimal point, let's count the number of digits to the right of the decimal point. 1. Then, the answer is 14. Another given. 3 and 36 hundreds times 42. Okay, as you can see, yung ating multiplier, dalawa na digit niya, no? pero whole number siya. And yung multiplicand natin, mixed decimals pa rin. Ano? So, yun ang pag-multiply niyan, just, yung procedure, just like how we multiply a whole number. So, yung paglalagay ng decimal point ay sa final product na lang. Alright, so 2 times 6 is 12. Write down 2, regroup 1. 2 times 3 is 6, plus 1 is 7. 2 times 3 is 6. So, this is the first partial product. And then, yung second partial product, so, ito yun yung second multiplier natin. 4 times 6 is 24. Write down 4, regroup 2. So, 4 times 3 is 12, plus 2 is 14. So, regroup 1. 4 times 3 is 12, plus 1 is 13. Alright, then afterwards, mag add tayo. And then, as you can see nga pala, yung second partial product natin, dapat yan ay naka-indent. Yung 4 na to, hindi pwedeng itapat kay 2, dapat nakapasok siya. Then, mag add na tayo, bring down 2, 7 plus 4 is 11, write down 1, regroup 1, 1 plus 6 is 7, plus 4 is 11, write down 1, regroup 1, 1 plus 3 is 4, and then bring down 1. And then, yung paglalagay ng decimal point, we're going to count the number of digits to the right of the decimal point. 1, 2, 1, 2. Then the answer is 141 and 12 hundreds. That's all for now. Thank you for watching.